Heidi Horton's German husband, Helmut Horton, is widely acknowledged for building his businesses during the Holocaust, capitalizing on the pressures imposed on Jewish families to divest their business assets. Following Heidi Horton's passing, approximately 700 pieces from her jewelry collection were auctioned at Christie's. In a just and commendable decision, it was determined that all proceeds from the auction would be dedicated to supporting medical research and various philanthropic endeavours. Furthermore, a portion of the proceeds is earmarked to benefit organisations actively involved in Holocaust education and research. So let's explore the most iconic Heidi Horton's jewellery pieces. Before we start, please support my channel by clicking like and subscribe buttons. Bulgari Diamond, Sapphire and Emerald Necklace Heidi Horton's Bulgari Jewellery Collection is widely regarded as one of the top five Bulgari collections globally, boasting numerous bespoke pieces and significant gemstones. Among the standout Bulgari items in her collection is an extraordinary necklace adorned with diamonds, sapphires and emeralds, prominently featuring a remarkable 46.56 carat round brilliant cut diamond at its core. Originally part of a ring sold by Cartier in 1975, the diamond underwent a transformative journey. Acquired by Harry Winston, it was later reimagined into a stunning necklace by Bulgari, eventually finding its way into Heidi Horton's possession in 1994. This remarkable jewellery piece made waves at a Christie's auction in May 2023, fetching an astonishing sum of over $1.6 million. The Sunrise Ruby At the forefront of the Heidi Horton collection is an exquisite and exceptionally rare ruby and diamond ring crafted by Cartier. This remarkable piece showcases a cushion-cut gem known as the Sunrise Ruby, weighing an impressive 25.59 carats and displaying a rich pigeon blood red hue with exceptional clarity. In the realm of colored gemstones, the Burmese pigeon blood ruby stands out as the most rare and valuable. Renowned for its deeply saturated color and natural fluorescence, is hailed by industry experts as the epitome of beauty in its category. This extraordinary ring achieved a historic milestone when it was auctioned at Sotheby's in Geneva in May 2015, fetching an astounding $30.42 million and earning the esteemed title of the world's most expensive ruby at that time. However, this record was surpassed in 2023 when the Estrella de Fula ruby was sold at auction in June for an impressive $34.8 million. Briarlet of India The Briarlet of India necklace features a remarkable 90.38 carat D-color South African diamond, uniquely cut in the seldom-seen Briarlet style. This distinctive cut covers the entire surface of the large drop with hundreds of meticulously placed triangular facets, creating a mesmerizing effect. The diamond underwent its transformation into the distinctive briolet shape in Paris and was subsequently sold to Cartier in the early 20th century. In 1911, Cartier sold the diamond, now set in a brooch, to the American financier George Blumenthal. In 1950, the diamond found its way into the possession of Harry Winston, who made it the focal point of a necklace adorned with marquise and pear-shaped diamonds. This exquisite necklace was then sold to Horton in 1971. In 2023, the Briarlet of India necklace was featured in a Christie's auction, commanding a staggering sum of more than $7.3 million. The Great Mogul Horton's selective acquisition of only the most exceptional pieces 
underscores her discerning taste for exquisite craftsmanship, innovative design, and a particular affinity for vibrant colors, especially shades of green. Among her remarkable collection of emeralds stands out the Great Mogul, a carved emerald and diamond necklace crafted by Harry Winston. This extraordinary emerald, dating back to the 19th century, weighs an impressive 362.45 carats and is intricately carved with scenes from the epic Ramayana. The necklace, fashioned in 18 karat yellow gold and platinum, exemplifies a perfect blend of artistic finesse and luxurious materials. Remarkably, this masterpiece was auctioned at Christie's in 2023, fetching an approximate sum of $1 million, a testament to its enduring beauty and historical significance. Three-strand pearl necklace Included in Horton's collection is another masterful creation by Winston, a three-strand necklace adorned with 175 natural saltwater pearls. The necklace is further enhanced by a cushion-cut fancy light pink diamond clasp, boasting an impressive weight of 11.15 carats. The pearls themselves exhibit remarkable size, displaying a delightful pink hue and an astonishing luster, making this necklace truly one of the finest pearl ensembles ever presented at auctions. Comprising three strands of graduated natural pearls ranging from approximately 14 to 7.5 millimeters, with an additional cultured pearl, the necklace is expertly crafted in 18 karat white gold. This Harry Winston masterpiece became the focal point of attention at auctions in 2023, commanding an astounding sum of more than $7.4 million, underscoring its exceptional beauty and value. Egyptian Revival Sotwar Another extraordinary addition to Horton's collection is a rare Van Cleef and Arpels Egyptian Revival Sotoir from 1924, adorned with diamonds, rubies, emeralds, and onyx, an acquisition made from Christie's in Geneva in 2018. The early 20th century witnessed a surge in Egyptomania in jewellery production, especially after the discovery of Tutankhamun's tomb, with Van Cleef and Arpels and Cartier leading the way in pioneering this style. This particular sotor, depicting a winged scarab above the goddess Mat, symbolizing truth and harmony, is an exceedingly rare find in the realm of Egyptian revival jewels. The piece, considered of museum quality, is one of only two known necklaces of this design, with the whereabouts of the other example remaining a mystery. At the auction in 2023, this exceptional jewel achieved a final price of $3.1 million. As mentioned earlier, Heidi was an avid admirer of Bulgai. The pieces she amassed in the 1970s, 1980s, and 1990s perfectly embody Bulgari's distinctive style from that era. These vintage items are characterized by an abundance of yellow gold, striking color combinations, and the use of cabochon cuts featuring sapphires, emeralds, and rubies. The allure of such Bulgari designs is evident in the intense competition they generate at auctions today. These pieces encapsulate the glamour and hedonism reminiscent of La Dolce Vita. Notable personalities like Sophie Loren, Gina Lollabrigida and Elizabeth Taylor were also counted among Bulgari's regular clientele. Collectors now seek vintage pieces in impeccable condition that epitomize the unique style of their respective eras, and the Bulgari pieces from Horton's collection stand out as the epitome of excellence.
That's it for today. Thanks for watching. Please do not forget to support my channel by clicking like and subscribe buttons.